Oumuamua, a name derived from the Hawaiian word meaning scout or messenger, is an interstellar object that passed through our solar system. It is the first known object to do so. Discovered in 2017, its appearance sparked a flurry of scientific activity and public interest. Why did it capture our imagination? Firstly, its origin is outside our solar system, making it unique. This was confirmed by its hyperbolic trajectory, which indicated it was not bound by the sun's gravity. Secondly, its unusual shape and acceleration behavior were unlike anything seen before. These factors combined to make Oumuamua a subject of intense scrutiny and speculation. The discovery opened up a new chapter in the study of interstellar objects. Until then, all known asteroids and comets originated within our solar system. Oumuamua showed that objects from other star systems could visit us, carrying potentially valuable information. This realization led to several theories about what Oumuamua might be, ranging from scientific to speculative. The discovery of Oumuamua was serendipitous. On October 19, 2017, Robert Warrick noticed an object moving unusually fast. Initially thought to be a comet or asteroid, its speed and trajectory revealed it was something else. Follow-up observations determined its hyperbolic path, indicating an interstellar origin. Its discovery was a collaborative effort. The object was about 800 meters long and 80 meters wide, cigar-shaped. It was accelerating in a way that gravity alone could not explain. This led to various theories about its nature. One of the first theories proposed was that Oumuamua was an asteroid. Asteroids are rocky objects that orbit the sun, and they can have irregular shapes. The elongated shape of Oumuamua could fit this category. However, its acceleration puzzled scientists. Normally, asteroids do not accelerate unless acted upon by an external force. The idea was that Oumuamua might be a fragment of a larger body. Perhaps it was ejected from its original star system during a collision or a close encounter with a planet. This would explain its high speed and peculiar trajectory. Yet, this did not account for its acceleration away from the sun. Another asteroid-related theory suggested that Oumuamua could be composed of a highly reflective material. This would cause it to exhibit unusual behavior when reflecting sunlight. But even this did not fully explain its acceleration. The asteroid theory, while plausible, left many questions unanswered. Another theory posited that Oumuamua was a comet. Comets are icy bodies that release gas and dust when they approach the sun, creating a visible coma and tail. This outgassing could provide the necessary thrust to explain Oumuamua's acceleration. However, there was a problem with this theory. No visible coma or tail was detected around Oumuamua. Typically, comets display a noticeable cloud of material as they outgas. The lack of such a feature made the comet theory less likely, but not impossible. Some scientists suggested that Oumuamua could be a dry comet, with little volatile material to create a visible coma. Further observations revealed that Oumuamua's surface was reddish, similar to some known comets. This supported the idea that it could have a cometary origin. However, without direct evidence of outgassing, the comet theory remained speculative. The mystery of its true nature persisted. Section 5, Speculative Theories, Alien Technology The most controversial theory was that Oumuamua could be an alien spacecraft. This idea was proposed by some scientists who noted that the object's unusual acceleration might be explained by artificial means. Could it be a probe sent by an advanced civilization? This theory captured the public's imagination. Supporters of this theory pointed to the object's unusual shape and behavior as evidence. They suggested it could be a solar sail a type of spacecraft that uses radiation pressure from stars to propel itself. This would explain its acceleration without visible outgassing. However, this idea faced significant skepticism. Most scientists argued that extraordinary claims require extraordinary evidence. Without concrete proof, the alien technology theory remained speculative. Nonetheless, it highlighted the need for more data and observations to understand Oumuamua's true nature. In Section 6. Introduction to the James Webb Space Telescope The James Webb Space Telescope, or JWS, is a marvel of modern engineering. Launched in December 2021, it is the largest and most powerful space telescope ever built. JWS observes the universe in infrared light, revealing objects invisible to other telescopes. 
Its mission is to study the universe's origins, star and planet formation, and potential for life. JWS detects faint signals from distant galaxies and analyzes exoplanet atmospheres. Its large segmented mirror provides unprecedented resolution and sensitivity. Section 7, JWS's Capabilities and Instruments. JWST is equipped with a suite of state-of-the-art instruments. These include the near-infrared camera, or NERCAM, the near-infrared spectrograph, known as NERSPEC, and the mid-infrared instrument, or MIRI. Each instrument is designed to observe different aspects of the cosmos, from distant galaxies to nearby asteroids. NIRCAM is used for imaging and spectroscopy in the near-infrared range. It can capture high-resolution images of celestial objects, revealing details that are invisible in visible light. NIRSPEC, on the other hand, is a multi-object spectrograph that can analyze the light from up to 100 objects simultaneously. This allows scientists to study the chemical composition and physical properties of these objects. MIRI covers the mid-infrared range and is capable of observing cooler objects, such as dust clouds and distant comets. It can detect the heat emitted by these objects, providing valuable information about their composition and structure. Together, these instruments make JWS a powerful tool for studying Oumuamua. Section 8. How JWS could study Oumuamua. JWST's advanced capabilities could provide new insights into Oumuamua. By observing the object in infrared light, JWST can detect features that are invisible to other telescopes. This could help determine its composition, structure, and origin. For example, if Oumuamua is a comet, JWST could detect traces of outgassing that were missed by other observations. Spectroscopy, one of JWST's strengths, could reveal the chemical makeup of Oumuamua. By analyzing the light reflected or emitted by the object, scientists can identify the elements and molecules present on its surface. This information could help distinguish between a rocky asteroid, an icy comet, or something entirely different. Furthermore, JWSE's high-resolution imaging could provide detailed views of Oumuamua's shape and surface features. This could help explain its unusual elongated shape and provide clues about its formation. By combining these observations, scientists hope to unravel the mystery of Oumuamua. Section 9. Possibility of Oumuamua's Return The chances of Oumuamua returning to our solar system are slim. Its hyperbolic trajectory means it is on an outbound path, likely never to return. However, this does not mean the end of interstellar object exploration. Scientists are actively searching for other objects like Oumuamua that might pass through our solar system. New telescopes and observation programs are being developed to detect interstellar visitors. The Vera C. Rubin Observatory, for example, is expected to revolutionize our ability to discover and track such objects. With these advancements, the chances of detecting another Oumuamua-like object in the future are high. If another interstellar object is discovered, it could provide another opportunity to use JWST and other advanced telescopes to study it. Each new discovery adds to our understanding of these mysterious visitors and their potential role in the cosmos. The future of interstellar object exploration looks promising. Section 10. Future of Interstellar Object Exploration The discovery of Oumuamua has sparked a new interest in interstellar objects. Scientists are now more aware of the possibility of such visitors and are better equipped to study them. Future telescopes and missions will improve our ability to detect, track, and analyze these objects as they pass through our solar system. One exciting possibility is the development of missions specifically designed to intercept and study interstellar objects. These missions could provide direct observations and samples, offering unprecedented insights into the nature of these visitors. Such missions would require international collaboration and advanced technology, but could yield groundbreaking discoveries. In the meantime, ground-based and space-based telescopes will continue to play a crucial role. By improving our observation capabilities, we can increase the chances of detecting interstellar objects and studying them in detail. The future of interstellar object exploration holds great promise and potential for new discoveries. Section 11. Broader Implications for Interstellar Exploration The study of Oumuamua and other interstellar objects has broader implications for our understanding of the universe. These objects carry information from other star systems, revealing details about their formation and materials. 
This knowledge helps us understand the diversity of planetary systems beyond our own. Techniques developed to study these objects can be applied to other areas of astronomy. Advances in spectroscopy and imaging improve our ability to study exoplanets. This informs the search for life elsewhere in the universe. The discovery of Oumuamua highlights the importance of international collaboration in space science. By working together, scientists can share data and expertise to achieve common goals. This collaborative approach is essential for advancing our understanding of the cosmos. In conclusion, the discovery of Oumuamua has opened new avenues for interstellar exploration. With advanced telescopes like JWSE, we are poised to uncover the mysteries of these fascinating visitors.